Three, two. Hello and welcome to Bruin TV's video announcements. We're coming to you live from Studio 119. I'm Ginger Turner. And I'm Logan Van Pearson. And, and this, this is, is Bruin TV. TV. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. Attention, salute, pledge. Allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. We have a number of events going on next week. Let's take a look at them. On Monday, there's a, soccer, there's a boys' soccer parent meeting at 7. Tuesday, we have a world language club meeting at 10 and there's a BHS FAFSA workshop at 6 in the Freshman Academy. On Thursday, the BHS Orchestra has their fall concert at 7. The Bruin Brigade, Bruin Brigade send off show starts at 7.45 at Custer Stadium. And Friday, football kicks off at 7 as the Bruins take on Sand Springs. Saturday, there's an AC ACT virtual meeting for students and parents from 10 to 12.30. That's all the things going on here this week. Our Bartlesville High School cross country team is nearing the end of its season. This Saturday we have the regional qualifiers and it's going to take all we have to qualify for state. So if you aren't busy this weekend, come out and watch us at Mohawk Soccer Complex at 10 a.m. We could use your encouragement and help cheer us on through this postseason battle. Our BHS choir is very talented and they're on their road to Allstate. Bruin TV's Noah Bartholomew has more information. Every year many students around Oklahoma audition for high school Allstate choir. Ms. Green is one of the choir directors at BHS and is helping students prepare for their auditions. So Allstate is a great opportunity for our uh, vocal music students. Um, they go through a very rigorous audition process uh, with very advanced collegiate literature of music. Um, they uh, have to learn four very difficult pieces and then uh, they go to um, an audition set by uh, our state and they compete in two rounds. So if they finish the first round uh, and advance, then they go to a second round in November. And then if they make the second round, then they're selected for the chorus, which is uh, made up of the best singers in the state of Oklahoma, and they perform a concert in January. How do students prepare for all state? So the students uh, get their music usually in the summertime or in early August and um, our students have been coming to clinics. Uh, we've had some uh, guest speakers come and give master classes. Uh, they learn their notes in those clinics with us in person and they also have tracks that they can practice with at home to learn the music and the pronunciations. Many of the pieces are in uh, foreign languages and uh, so they continue that practice and then they come to rehearsals here after school or during advisory or whenever we can um, make the available time. So best of luck to all of our students that are auditioning here at BHS. Sing well! The first round of auditions will be on October 30th. From Bruin TV, I'm Noah Bartholomew. The BHS Palm is an exciting event coming up next week. This is Bruin TV's Zoe McClister has more. We know you've seen Palm out on the sidelines cheering us on, but did you know they're hosting a dance invitational? Here's Tristan and Addie for more. The event is October 30th. The event helps us raise money to, in order for us to go to nationals and just gives us an opportunity to dance and compete with other teams. Our three coaches created this invitational last year when um, competitions weren't really happening and we needed some place to perform in front of people and get a chance to actually compete. Don't forget to come out on October 30th in the Bruin Fieldhouse to support our Palm. That's all for this week's live Bruin TV video announcements. Watch each week to find out information around BHS in our community. I'm Logan Van Pearson. And I'm Gentry Turner. And, and this, this is, is Bruin TV. TV.